was a red dawn the morning our Tiger tank first arrived on the front lines. PC rounds, all motor. Hydraulic takeoff, 600 PS to join. Target acquired. Fire at will. There she is. Come to Papa. Ground up. Shot out. Bound Radio HQ. The Star Formant has two more kills. Jawohl. I have a pack one kilometer out. Engage. Turn it turn. It was there on the Eastern Front we made a name for ourselves. By the spring of 44, we had been redeployed to the Western Front, France. I gave orders to move at first light, directing the bulk of my Panzer Company ahead to point 213. The Star Formant was moving slowly. We had engine trouble. Brand new motor that runs like Scheisse. Panzergruppen! Confirmed. Fisch bereit! Ready for combat! Drone broken! Miss Stark! Power turret! Sighting new target! Tommy put up a good fight, but the German people thought our tanks were unstoppable. We had to return to Villa Bocage to show them that they were. Last time I saw the interior of a Tiger tank. The last time I saw Schultz. He went on to command the 502 Tiger Gruppe. On August 9th, 1944, he held the advancing Americans at Autry long enough to allow our division to escape Normandy. He died in his Tiger. By September, what was left of our division redeployed to Holland. I assumed command of the Panzerlehr Division as Major General. It had seemed so clear, so necessary. But in the end, senior command had lost its way. And unfortunately, the Fatherland followed. 